Here's a review of Batman Arkham City in 2023 in roughly 60 seconds. Few sequels can truly improve what didn't work before while further improving what did work. Does that make it a perfect game? No, but it makes it one that regardless of its quality, commands respect. The combat has been given new depth and fluidity, allowing attacks to be cancelled by counters, the world has opened up giving us a city to explore, and the traversal follows suit, offering a faster means of getting around. Stealth is given more tools, and to counter this, enemies have been buffed as well. The biggest improvement made was with the boss fights, some of which see you using a samurai sword to cut down Clayface, and others being some of the best in gaming at the time. The story here is much better than Asylum, but suffers from a feeling of being a wild goose chase, hunting down a cure on a Stick, acting less as a means of furthering a theme, and rather as a means of introducing and fighting new villains. Ultimately, trying to fit all the things this game does right, characters, side quests, bosses, presentation, into 60 seconds is a near impossible task. But the fact remains that if you haven't played this game, then you are missing out big time. Want to hear my full thoughts? Click the link in my bio.